Hey YouTube, this is John here with beer, bourbon, and bushcraft. Tonight we got a special video for you. The weather's finally turned here in Kentucky. So we're out at the forge tonight. Going to do a heat treat on the bushcraft knife that is the giveaway. See, I've got it fully forged out, got the preliminary grind done on it, stabilize the metal, and it's ready for heat treat. So what we're going to do, we're going to throw it in the forge for a few minutes till it gets nice and hot, non-magnetic. We're going to quench it in the oil, see a nice light show with some fire, and then be ready to be cleaned up, have some scales put on it, and ready for the giveaway. So let's go ahead and get this sucker in the forge. You can see this forge is nice and hot. It's running probably 24, 2500 degrees right now. It'll only take a couple minutes for that knife to get up to heat treat temperature. Quench it, I've got some oil here that I've been heating up. This is my quenching oil. Dip it in there, it'll be a nice fire show a couple different times. And the knife will be heat treated. Ready for some final sanding, final grinding. Put the scales on it, good to go. Getting close. Don't want to overheat it because you can burn your metal. It'll actually start to melt. If I pull this out and it's sparkling like a sparkler, it's gone too far, way too much heat. Got to be careful with it. Keep a good eye on it. Get the tip a little bit more. You want a nice, nice bright orange glow. At that point, the metal becomes non-magnetic. The molecules start to align, kind of like that there, and it's ready for heat treat. And once you quench it quickly, it'll harden the steel so it'll hold a nice edge. This knife's 1095 steel, which is a high carbon steel. Great for knife making. That's perfect. Here we go. All right, knife's cooling down now. It's quenched. Should be good and hard. It's got a nice bit of scale on it. Gotta take care of that with some sandpaper and some final grinding. Hone the edge on it, put the scales on it. Then I'll start building a custom Kydex sheath, sheath for this. Remember, at 100 subscribers, one of you is gonna win this hand forged knife. And you actually get to see part of the process here. I'll probably shoot another video when I'm making the Kydex sheath for it because that thing's gonna be outstanding. So until next time, I'm John, Beer, Bourbon, and Bushcraft. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. See ya.